What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Good afternoon and welcome to an update on the Trust Wallet token, or TWT. In this video, we'll talk about the technicals, mostly about the technicals, but we'll also talk about some fundamentals and just in general, uh, what you can expect from uh, TWT. It was requested by some of you. Um, I know that there's uh, there's quite a few people who hold and, uh, and trade uh, TWT around Selenix Crypto. Uh, so this is for you. Uh, we're, we're pretty bullish today with TWT, one of the most bullish cryptos today, at least uh, volume and also over the last few months, but that's a different story. Uh, volume has dropped down significantly. It's still pretty high compared to the market cap. It's still OK, but it's weekend volume drops down. It's the way it is um, and a great project. But uh, yeah, maybe a little bit inflated. Obviously, it was very bullish because everything uh, because of everything that happened with FTX. And then what happened with Binance and everything, and then they had some uh, some promotions of their own. Uh, but that has all ended now, and we got some uh, bearish fundamentals heading into the weekend. Um, you can see Friday was a, was a very bearish day. We received some bearish news around the exchanges and just in general some fallout from uh, from the interest rate still. So we dropped down, and that brings us to uh, I mean we we touched all the way up this uh, at the support level around 1.25. Um, but right now we're a little bit more bullish. You can see that we um, recovered a little bit, found resistance around 1.6, which is a key level as well. Uh, but today we managed to break above that, already confirmed that as well. So the, the situation now is that we have this 1.6, 1.65 uh, cent level as a support. And what's probably going to happen today leading up to tomorrow is we'll probably uh, recover a little bit more. Right now we're struggling with 1.75, but that's a minor resistance level. I think we'll get up towards 1.85 and 1.9 uh, and this is a stronger resistance level which is clearly visible uh, so what i think we'll do is i think unless we get like like sunday into monday sometimes you have very strong institutional moves so big companies making moves uh, if for some reason in the night of sunday to monday we are able to break above 1.95 then we can actually become bullish and get up to like 2.15 and 2.2 again uh, but this is like a very s small chance. It's like 10, 15 percent. I think it's more likely uh, that given the f technicals and also the fundamentals we have right now, that we will get up to 1.9, 1.85. But that from there we will start dropping down towards 1.65 and that uh, 1.5 level again. Now, I do think 1.5 will hold for a little bit longer. But if we don't get any bullish momentum from the market, what will just happen is that it will just be a matter of time before 1.5 breaks and that will drop down to this 1.3, 1.25 level. Again, you could argue. And then uh, we'll consolidate on top of that level because that level is, uh, is significantly stronger than, uh, than all the other levels. And then we'll just consolidate. Um, but yeah, so I would say something, at least this initial part, the drop down to 1.5 is the most likely scenario given the fundamentals we have and given the market circumstances right now, which are... Uh, far from bullish obviously it's, it's and uh, a reason which I, I did not name yet but like TWT also dropped down a little bit more because there was as I said about the exchanges there was some negative news around Binance and Binance is a majority stakeholder or at least a big stakeholder in the trust wallet and um, so because of that link between TWT did I delete something yeah well, uh, because of that link between TWT and Binance, it also dropped down a little bit more. But yeah, so I would expect that we will drop down to 1.5. Now, dropping down to 1.3, 1.25, that would only happen if like Bitcoin and Ethereum start dropping down to 16,000 and 1,075 respectively. Um, so that, that, that depends on the market, but that initial drop to me, unless we get that big institutional move Sunday to Monday, seems the most likely scenario. So that's my take on TWT for now. If you do have any questions, as always, let me know. But for now, take care and bye.